Ronaldinho to take. Hit him with pace, and it's a goal! Well, they'd worked on that, and it's Luis Fabiano that scored it. Just helped it on, and so much pace in the initial kick. Real pace on the free kick, the touch from Luis Fabiano. And it's whipped away from Claudio Bravo. That will settle the nerves. Here's the latest from Fabiano. Diego was involved in that tournament as well. Came home with bronze medals. Clever. Diego. This looks good. And that could be a penalty. It's a yellow card. The penalty area. It's the follow through as much as anything. Foot's high there, there's the follow through. Caught the Brazilian in the midriff. A long delay. Oh, what a save! Ronaldinho went for power. And Bravo comes out on top. It just exploded into life again. Look at the pace and power in this shot. But not sufficient to beat Claudio Bravo and the man that conceded six goals in that Copa America quarter-final. Into the last minutes of the first half then. Luis Fabiano setting up Robinho, great goal, what a sweet, sweet strike that one was, and right on the stroke of half-time, Brazil... Great set-up play this by Luis Fabiano and Rubinho with an unerring finish. Nothing much on there, but look how quickly he got it under control, spotted Rubinho, and Rubinho just places it beyond Bravo. And Brazil are strolling this one now. Yes, they've missed a penalty, yes, they've had one cleared off the... Here's Joan. Josue. And Michael. <laughs> Luis Fabiano. Still in there. Luis Fabiano. It's three. That has been coming. It looked as though the chance had gone, but his persistence paid off. And Brazil.
Fabiano's goal-scoring prowess continues. Look at his strength here to hold off Medell, reclaim the ball, size up the chance through the legs of Bravo. And just as he did against Uruguay back in November, Luis Fabiano finds the net twice in a World Cup qualifier. It's now 12 goals in 20 appearances for his country. It's not a bad ratio to have at the top level, is it? And is he the man? To... Well, he's taken some of the pressure off himself, for the time being anyway. And Luis Fabiano has done his claims.